On this edition of HDTV Announcements, stay tuned for news on artwork, lost and found items, and... Sports, obviously. The news starts now. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, liberty and justice for all. Welcome back, hot dogs. I'm Liz. And I'm Nick. And for lunch today, on lines one, two, we'll be having cheeseburgers. Line three, hot dogs. Line four, lasagna and personal pan pizza. And line five, closed. Happy birthday goes out to Emily Anthony, Erwin Castillo, Violet Castro, Gabriela Cervantes, Ivan Santos, Yobani Trinado Alanis, and Mr. Kniff. In sports action, the hot dog varsity softball team squared off against Hamilton Heights yesterday, picking up the win 5-4 in walk-off fashion due to Kylie Norman's base hit in the bottom of the eighth. Avery Drew started the game, pitching six innings, allowing two hits with four unearned runs, and striking out six. Michaela Harper got the win for the dogs, pitching two innings, allowing zero hits, zero runs, and striking out one. The JV team kept the winning going as they defeated Hamilton Heights by a score of 6-5. Michaela Harper had two hits for the Dogs, and Katie Roberts picked up the win, pitching two innings, allowing five runs on four hits, and striking out four. Tonight, the girls varsity tennis team will be hosting and playing in the first match of the sectional against Western Boone. The match will be starting at 5.30, so make sure to come on out and show your support for the team. Are you a girl and looking for something to do this summer? Gotcha is a girls-only week-long camp where you can experience working on cars, constructing things from wood, learning about home electrical wiring, and welding metal. The camp is June 24th to the 28th from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. with funds provided. Online registration is available. Just check out one of the flyers posted around the school. Any questions, see Mr. Blunt, Mr. Munier, or Mr. Smith. If you have left artwork with Mr. Clark, please stop by his room at your earliest convenience to pick said artwork up. Any artwork not picked up by the end of the school year may find itself the starring role in next year's production of Homecoming Bonfire. There will be a lost and found table across the bookstore in the main entrance hallway today and tomorrow. Be sure to stop and look to see if any of the lost items are yours. And if you lost something valuable like jewelry or, or keys, please check with Mrs. Jameson. That's it for today and thank you for joining us. Make sure to like and subscribe and the truest words of Nolan Varner, have a gooder day.